Now I'd like to show you my secret witch's attic, which is where I keep all of my velvet cloaks and my costumes for Halloween, for masquerade balls. I have my book of shadows. This has all the really serious spells, like the cloak of invisibility spell. My witch doll given to me by the white witch, May, who's my very dear friend. She's like Glenda the Good Witch. We have a little candy blood in case you need a transfusion after Barnabas has bitten you. More witch bottles, of course. Ooh, a skeleton. And then I have my dear departed sister, Esmeralda, lying in state. You're welcome to come visit her. She's so pretty with that auburn hair. Look at that complexion. Just more collections. Lots of Dark Shadows postcards and cards from the DVDs over the years. More dresses. And then we come to my wall in here, which is filled with Dark Shadows like Barnabas, Quentin, Roger, Elizabeth and David, and some of my own artwork that I've done, um, cat cartoons of the Dark Shadows characters. There's Adam, and we have more over here. I just am so infatuated with that series. A lot of people, when they come visit me and it gets to this part of the tour, Honestly, they do become a little scared. I think they think I'm going to throw away the key. There's my Dark Shadows album. My beloved cat Spooky and his Ouija board he was so proud of. Yvonne DiCarlo, my grandmother. The Wiccan Reed. And then we also have my collection of VHS tapes from Dark Shadows and my pride and joy, my Barnabas Collins game. Now, I paid a lot for that on eBay, but it was worth every penny. So, this is where Hansel and Gretel love to come. So, I hope to get to show y'all this room. This is always the last room on the tour. So, when are you coming?